Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how to scan QR code on Telegram. So let's say you want to message one of your friend or you want to join a group and the, and the access you have is only the QR code. Maybe you don't have the link or something like that. And you want to message the person or you want to join the group. Let me show you how to scan the QR code. So if you open your Telegram application, there's actually no option for you to scan QR code. So if you click on settings right here, and you click on QR code, they are only going to show you your own QR code. So I'm going to show you how to scan the QR code on Android and on iPhone. Just wait till the end of this video. So if you are using iPhone, it is very easy. Just head over to your settings and you need to click on the QR code. Once click on the QR code, long click on the QR code itself and it's going to scan it. So it is very easy on iPhone. It's just long click on the QR code and your iPhone is automatically going to scan the QR code. So you can now see all this option. So you can open it in Telegram directly. You can open it in Safari. Just click on open in Telegram. It's going to open the person's chat. So let me cancel this. Can you see? It opens my saved messages because it is my private QR code. So if it is, if you are using Android device, just head over to your Play Store and you need to download uh, Google Photos. So you need to download this Google Photos on your Android device, it is available on the App Store and Play Store. So just open it and you need to select the screenshot of the QR code. Once you select it, you need to click on this Google Lens right here. Once you click on Google Lens, it's going to scan the QR code. So just wait for a few seconds and it's going to scan the QR code. I don't know why this is taking a lot of time. Can you see that it has scanned this QR code and they are going to show it right here. So you can now copy it and paste it in your browser or just click on website directly from this place. So once you click on website, it's going to open the link in your browser. So I don't know why it is not working, but let me just copy it and paste it in my browser. So let me paste it in my browser and it's going to redirect you to your telegram. Can you see? So it is very easy. Just try this out. Just use your photos app on your iPhone. And if you are using Android, you can use Google Photos and make use of the Lens option. So if your own is not working in Photos on iPhone, you can also download Google Photos and make use of it. If you found this video helpful, smash the like button and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos like this. Thanks for watching, guys.